Welcome to Ashman Little Sister. Today, we're going to show you how to replace the bacterial filter on your SES 2020N and SES 3000B autoclaves. The bacterial filter ensures that air taken into the chamber during a sterilization cycle is free from bacterial pathogens. Every 1000 cycles, you'll see a reminder to change the bacterial filter. You can dismiss the message by pressing OK, giving you time to order a new filter if you don't have one, but the reminder will display between each cycle until you have replaced the filter. Before you change the bacterial filter, make sure the autoclave is cool enough for you to be able to touch the metal parts of the door and chamber face. We recommend allowing the unit to cool with the door open for at least 30 minutes. To remove the old filter, just grip it firmly and pull it out. You might find it comes out easier if you wiggle it a bit from side to side. You can dispose of the old filter in your general waste. Take the new filter and push it into place. Now you need to register the change in the autoclave software. This will prevent reminder messages appearing too soon. Tap the wrench icon to get to the settings menu and enter your pin code. Use the up and down arrows to highlight maintenance then tap OK. Then tap the white play symbol. Tap OK and then the back arrow to confirm and reset the unit. And that's it. We hope this guide has been useful. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more guides and tips and contact us if you need further help or advice.